Okay, let's talk about the cold fusion tag CF output. CF output is a cold fusion tag that you use to output stuff to the web browser. It's primarily used, if you don't use it with any other special tags like CF setting, in outputting values of variables and record sets. So, you can put a variable name in between a couple of pound signs and instead of outputting pound signs in the, and that name, it'll output the value in its place. You can use other things like, like I mentioned, record sets. So, as you're looping through a record set, you can say the record set name dot the column name and it'll replace that, of course this is in pound, pound signs, it'll replace that and it will put the value of that column for the current record in its place. In addition, you can take variables, regular plain variables, output them that way. You can take client variables and output them that way. Cookie variables and output them that way. CGI um, values and output it that way. And other things of similar nature, structures, etc. There are several parameters that you can add to the CF output tag. Generally, I don't recommend using them. You can use query, for example, and if you say query equals query name, and the query name is in quotes, it'll refer to a query you've done with a CF query tag. And it basically creates a loop. Anytime you use the record set name, dot the column name, in pound signs, inside your opening and closing CF output tags with the query specified, the query name specified, it will output that value and it'll do a loop so that eventually everything in that record set for that column will be outputted. Of course you can mix it with HTML and other values too. Generally speaking though, I don't like using the CF output tag with the query attribute. The reason is that when you start merging data and it starts getting more complex, and trust me, if you're going to create any kind of website that, that is, does anything, it's going to get complex. I know at work it has for me. The CF, to, to get the stuff done with the CF output tag that you want to get done will become very tricky. So my recommendation is if you're going to loop through a query and output it, don't use the CF query parameter attribute in your CF output tag. Use the CF loop tag instead and then use CF output inside without any parameters to output the results. So what will that do for you? It'll make it so that you can use other things besides the particular query that's being specified. It means that you can use several queries at the same time to results in the output you're generating and it won't have to be delineated as, as specifically. You have more control. That's basically what, what you have.